everyone. Um, sorry for the delay. Uh, brain, brain smooth. Brain smooth and frictionless, like bowling ball. Except bowling ball also has like three roughly adjacent holes for you to actually get a grip of. So it's even worse than the bowling ball. It's just a perfect billiard ball, if you will. Small and round and absolutely, well, nearly frictionless. There is at least some level of friction, otherwise the eight ball would fucking escape. Would reach, it, would reach escape velocity fairly quickly and just disappear into the stratosphere before disintegrating in a sonic boom. And I've already derailed myself. Fucking hell. Welcome back to Sunday Gold. I am having a beer. And I'm sorry, I haven't remained a set in absolutely ages. Stupid little plastic people have been occupying a large amount of my time as I wait for 10th edition of Warhammer to kick in. Anyway, when we were previously here, we were trying to get this corpse out of the way of this chute so we can get some people out the fucking way. To achieve this, we go over here, and we move, look, to the right. Once more nudge on the joystick, and then we open the chute. Here we go. Good job, Frank, we see you. Hey, looks like I found a way to get you two up here after all. Why are you still talking to me on the phone? Force of habit, I guess. Can you find something to help us up? The chute is covered with ice, blood, and guts. Hold tight. I'll come up with something. And that is really just as simple as lowering the hook. There we go. Oh, lovely. Just try not to snag yourself on the end. And there we go. <laughs> Great improvisation skills you showed there. I knew you could do it, Frank. Shut up and let's get out of here before my, my, my bloody b balls freeze off. Ah yes, I, I forgot that the entire crew was kind of collectively losing their shit. We should, we should probably leave. Right. Well. So, Gavin, this is where you. Yeah. This is the place. I came in through that very door and found them. No need to go through the whole thing. We need you focused. They were facing away from the door. I grabbed a knife from the cold room. My hand was numb from the cold steel. Hey, snap out of it. Then it went dark. Okay, we need to get the fuck out of here. Now. Let's grab the evidence before he loses control. I'm in control. For now. I'm sure Gavin's absolutely fine. Let's get a move on. Oh god, his composure's even more in the fucking toilet. God damn it, Gavin. Could you please contain your shit for 30 seconds? Right, well. I was gonna try and hack, unfortunately, Gavin is, uh. Oh, it's worth giving it a go, I suppose. Jesus Christ. Yeah, low in low sanity really does not help. Oh good, I found some painkillers. And some adrenaline. Fantastic! My mind is still fraying at the seams like a wet cake, but I found a shitload of adrenaline and oh thank god some paint some tranquilizers. Absolutely fuck loads, okay, fair enough. Not gonna say no to that I guess. Already had a look at all of this kind of stuff. Right. Let's have someone who maybe doesn't need to uh, melt their frontal lobe look at some of this stuff. Let's have a look here. Can hack that. Oh, it's all hacking. Fan fucking tastic. Really didn't want to waste my goddamn time, but I guess we do need Gavin to do all of this. Uh... There we go. Six four double six. Nice. Uh, God damn it, how much effort does it take to search a mechanical locker? Wearable device, gonna need to take a closer look at this to find its function. Well, well, I'll have a closer look then. That's what the inventory's here for. That and possibly stitching together my mates once again. 
Forgot that was a human arm there for a second. Neural guard interface. Dell's works with perception to help them maintain a composure. Also serves as directly to electronic devices. Could probably do with putting that on, um... Oh shit, in fact, that's actually perfect for Gavin. Right, Gavin, you probably require... Yeah, it improves my intake of composure, but I want to stop it leaving me. So you know what, let's equip that instead. Right. Could probably do with just blashing one of those. Just give all this shit to Sally first. Right, and then Sally can actually use this. Let's see, lethargic stress resistance. Rest that will just straight it right. Use that on Al Gavarino. And you know what? Let's use that on Gavin as well. Just to bring him up to some level of fucking sanity. And let's use these on Frank to bring him roughly back up to speed. There we go. Everyone's alive and mostly sane. Insofar as I think anyone can really be uh, upward and <laughs> functional. Wait, how did that fucking... That improved... That... Wait, did I give him the wrong fucking thing? Right. Improve your fucking composure, you dick. God fucking damn it. Oh god, right. Well, now I need to deal with this shit, and that means I need to get Gavin to... Right, do I wait, or do I just... You know what, I won't mind... I'll actually take the fucking combat right now, because it will help me re get my AP out of the way. So let's reset. Rock on. Oh good, it's a fucking dog. Alright, time to murder the local security guards again. Holy shit! Yeah, I mean, there. The fucking lattice, you say. Oh, there we go. 50 notches. There we go. Destroy some more. Ah, Sally levels up. There we go. Let's fucking crack on. Let's go points, but say no to that. Very fucking nice. Right, and everyone's composure is actually, I think, a little better than previously. That's never going to hurt. Right, Sally. Welcome our grade here. I mean... Just straight up make her more resistant to damage. Seems like a pretty good move. And that just flat out improves everyone's... Uh... Oh, you know what? Oh no, that's already, that's already there. Right. Oh, let's upgrade that again. Just to turn it into an absolute fucking brick wall. Right, unfortunately this means more hacking. Hang on a second. More hacking! Yay! Oh Christ. Dear Sir Stroke Madam, fire! Exclamation mark. Fire! Exclamation mark. <laughs> Help me! Exclamation mark. Oh, there we go. What have we got here? That's not something we can wear. I wonder what he does. There's none of these are evidence of how good experiments. God damn it, I'm just nicking shit for the sake of nicking shit. God damn it, what did I find? Integrity protection implant. I think I lost that quite some time ago, but alright, sure. Okay. Immunity to all the negative debuffs, but I don't need to really worry about that. Cool. Wish I could sell gear, I guess, but okay. Some rather large tanks are in quite a few of them, but all hidden too. Right, so I found all of that. Where the fuck does it want me to go? We feel some of the good stuff, and well, I'll be drunk and still in front of a locked door. <laughs> Entirely fair, I suppose. Right, so I'm clearly missing a trick here. Experiment schedule. Reverse necrosis makes up most of it, but it's pretty important. Lovely. Label reads, Eternal Life Elixir. Probably just hyperbole. Hopefully. 
The Petri dish says reversed necrosis. What does that mean, medically speaking? It means so... Uh, I don't know. Well, necrosis is when cells die from too little blood flowing to the tissue. So reverse necrosis means the cells have been... brought back? If we're making fucking zomb... I mean, to be fair, we've got a horrible memes of robot dogs, so zombifying people does not necessarily seem out of the question. I suppose. But that would have some serious impact when you... Let's continue this over a pint once we get the hell out of here. <laughs> are we, we going to take some of this or what? It's been traditionally labeled reverse necrosis, day 20. Well, I can't take any of this for some absolutely arbitrary fucking reason, but alright, cool. Oh god, I've still got that fucking lock to pick, don't I? Right, let's open this. Oh, lovely, some corpses. So is this body. Oh, hello. <laughs> Gavin, you should not be looking at this. God damn it. I should have landed in the room, to be honest. Gavin, you said you stabbed your victims. I think you may have sold yourself short. I'm amazed he still has his head. <laughs> it's not the compliment I think you meant it to be. This is him, right? One of them. Yeah. Wait, it looks like he's still holding something. Must have been important if he held on to it. Let's find a way to get him to release it. Can you say, breaking his fucking fingers? Let's get going. Stop, oh, bollocks. There we go. Christ! His bloody oh. hands frozen shut around that key. It'd take a pry bar to get this thing loose. Think we could thaw it? No time for that. Sally, have one more go at it. Come on, give it everything you've got. <laughs> there it goes. Oh, God. Holy shit. Oh, the sound the fingers made. You snapped them. Yeah, mate, Rigor Mortis is kind of a bitch. Good thing he's wearing gloves then. <laughs> Thank you. Over IK, a small device containing preloaded network credentials of a Hogan Industries scientist. You really think they'd remove that from the corpse, but I guess they just didn't feel like it. Come to the Dorses employee 2701744, sealed shut. Can you say optional boss fight? Actually, I'd, I'd rather not. Right, I'm gonna take. Just try not to bring up a fucking lung. I had a really. <coughs> Fucking brutal cold for like a day. And I'm now going to be stuck with this shitty cough for what feels like a month. I'm going to have one more crack of this to see if I can bust it open because I would really like the gear that's in here. I am going to fucking snap my own vertebrae. God damn it. Right, never fucking mind. Leave. It's probably not that important. I suppose we now use the key card to open the fucking thing. There we go. Override key. Thank you very fucking much. That's ah, coming online. Oh, goody. That, oh, God. That's extremely encouraging. Poor dogs. Not just dogs. Yeah, uh, to be fair, I, I'll take the composure hit. That's entirely understandable. Fucking hell. Uh, <laughs> Everyone's out of AP. Are you fucking joking? God, fuck. Oh. This isn't good enough to be useful. Okay, he didn't explain that fucking thing before it happened, okay? Oh, fucking... Oh, 
Are you actually fucking kidding me right now? Do not... Do not do this, where you have the fucking instructions up here in the top left hand corner, and have the actual thing immediately start happening on the right hand side. Actual fucking bullshit. Let's give that another go. There we go. Fuck me, gently. Whoa. All these dogs. Poor creatures. Do you think these could be the missing dogs reported over the past year? Well, it explain how they could get all these specimens. We got nice clear pictures? Because people will go fucking insane when we release them. Time to get going. Definitely don't want to get caught in here. Right. Save again here. There we go. Fucking hell. And you know, the, the human test subjects this as well. This is fucking disgusting! What are they doing with these test subjects? They're keeping these people alive in tubes. Are we sure... they're alive? The monitors all have life signs on them. Heart rate, brain activity... You know, that, this is the worst they're Airbnb alive. in the country. Yeah, maybe not the worst, but definitely one of the least luxurious. Are they being experimented on? Is it organ harvesting? Cybernetic implants? I've never heard about any of this at Hogan Industries. How could they hide this right under everyone's noses? We've got the evidence. Let's chat anywhere but here, deal? Right, one more thing I need to take a picture of, apparently. I don't want to know what took place here. Right, uh, I'm assuming take pictures of something else. Oh, here we go. Skip Chadley. Yo, you two already have your fucking minds blown. Just got off the howler with reanimation nerds. By the way, that team is channeling some serious fucked upness. Said they're close to working a prototype of the fucking great white shark. A shark! Skip Chadley, executive producer of marketing business development. Hi, Skip. That's, um, interesting. I didn't know we're looking at aquatic options for new products. Skip, what the fuck? I heard it was a fur based exploration only, and the focus is pretty much going to be on that monster bear thing. By the way, how much are the company on the hook for with repairs to the Island Zero facility and all those death benefits? I'm curious what our KPIs are. We should stop. <laughs> we should start looking at securing some domain names, getting in sync with some of the ocean people, companies, such groups. It could be huge. People dig sharks. <laughs> Fucking hell. Vampire fans, okay. Hey, Astrid, slash Skip. Not sure you've been following the whole vampire fans thing of late. If not, it's basically Sunday Gold fans trying hard, and I mean really hard, to get blood on themselves during a race. Apparently, it started when Sunday Gold knocked one UK bank's capital gains into the stands a few weeks back. Serves them right for such a stupid name. There was a lot of blood and a lot of excitement amongst the fans. Sure, so capital gains blood ended up going for a pretty penny, and they're extremely sought after. Anyhow, got the creator works out some examples of new posters and whatnot. One that really jumped out at me was Donate Blood, Race Against Sunday Gold. Thoughts? <laughs> Fucking Christ, that's brutal. Right, consider this formal complaint. Bubba bubba bubba. Can you please tell me what you're saying? Would you bar? Fun out unless a good thought you can use radiation blast. Ah, oh, new. Okay, they're talking about a cybernetic bear, and that is concerning me on several levels. Right, one can only assume I need to go back in here and take a picture of maybe some of these horrible fucking corpses. Nope. Alright, what else am I taking a picture of here then? I guess it's incinerator from here. Yeah, but I guess we're not going out that way then. Unless I've actually got to pick that lock, in which case I'm absolutely fucked because I cannot seem to actually do that. Okay, take a photo of this. Fuck. Piss. Uh, Alright, can you fucking take a picture of that fucking file? There we go. It, it, admittedly, they're all having nervous breakdowns, so I can understand it being difficult to take a decent picture, but still, come on, man. There didn't need to be a fucking quick type event. 
Moral have now, enterprise. we have proof of Kenny's involvement in these projects. We have the project names and vague information about all of them. What's that gonna do for us? Don't underestimate that information. Knowing what to look for will help when we start snooping through the service. When my online community sees these photos, it'll be like tossing chum in shark-infested waters. So the London Nerd Regiment will spring into action? <laughs> hey look man, the 43rd Fusilier Otakus are not to be fucking trifled with. Oh, you've heard of us. Let's just focus on not getting caught. And that should be enough evidence to cause a stir. And you think we could turn that into money? Not this time, Gavin. Get on your compad and post the images to your community. What are you mad we need? I need that money! Okay, I'm ready to post the pictures. What do I do? Uh, you put an iFunny watermark at the bottom and then deep fry the image into absolute illegibility. Or just, you know, WikiLeaks. Trust me, Frank. I've got the big picture in mind. Post the images, Gavin. And... It's done. Knowing my team, the images will be everywhere in two or three hours. I hope your plan works. Wait, do you hear something? Sounds like someone's approaching. Well, I don't have a feeling I'm about to get anal. Well, on the plus side, I just leveled up, so if I'm gonna get anal, at least it's gonna be level 7 or level 8. Anal? What the fuck am I talking about? EMP Blast. Look, the Gavin just kind of rubs his thighs a lot to build up a charge, then zaps things. Good lad. There we fucking go. Right. Time to get murdered. Oh, god damn it, it's her again, isn't it? Oh, fuck. After that. Not today. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Down the trash chute. You think you can run from me? Um, I would like to. I don't think it's going to work, though. What you pissants always fail to realize, I'm always five moves ahead. The incinerator is primed for ignition. On your command, Mr. Ogan. Make it so. Ruth, why am I not hearing screams of agony? What the fuck? Uh, seems not enough power for an instant ignition. Maybe I need to kick you down that chute so you can take care of them in person. The incinerator needs a little more time to warm up before it fires. Shouldn't be more than a minute or two. I'll tell you what, love. I better hear some scrambling and wheeling pretty right quick. Or else. Oh, God. And I'll be right here if you three feel like begging for mercy. Probably won't help, but you never know. I wouldn't count on that, motherfucker! Ruth! You fucking bootlicker! Oh, good times. Oh, we're stuck in here, and the incinerator is powering on, and that asshole locked the door! There's gotta be a way to get out of here. I'm not giving that piece of shit the satisfaction. Stick around for something. I am not dying in this hellhole. Action point spent and reduced to incinerator's ignition count right above the door when it is. Okie dokie, so I have. An amount of time to get the fuck out of here, and... Fuck me, shotguns, nice. Okay, well, all of that's fantastic. However, I need to get the fuck out of here, and all of this shit is definitely not working in my favour. Hacking, shit, fuck, shit, fuck, fuck, shit. Right. Oh, 
this. <laughs> what kind of fucking code is that? Holy shit. There's another power cell. And a metal dog jaw. Jesus Christ. Crank that shit. Oh shit, that's off the grinder. We left that now. Okay, that wasn't working. My fucking god, I'm going to shit myself. I'm going to fucking invert myself. Feeling, I've completely fucked this and I can Oh wonderful, we're dead. We're, we're actually fucking Well, let's all die horribly in the fucking incinerator, shall we? And we're dead. Oh, no. 
brilliant. Would have really liked it if the game didn't fucking gatekeep progression behind having to do a lockpicking section. I have to do that whole fucking bit again. Oh, fuck off. Really?